What's that on the table? I don't know. It's scary. Let's go see what it is. Oh, wait. It's a Sarkis Supis toy. How could I have been so dumb? There. Nope. Fixed. There we go. Okay. This is the review. Not another unboxing thing. If you get confused with the two, read the title. And it'll just immediately click. Num, 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 num. I know I shouldn't change or stop my medication. Num, 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 num. So this is the... Where are the paints? Oh, legendary. And... The design? The texture. But in the design section, which is probably not what it's called, we have a, like, a gimmick section. 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 And, uh... A, 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 a articulation section. A um, we also have a um, a um, a detail section and a painting section. I had to recap all of that because it doesn't look good. So I want to do a cool pose for it. Like uh, I like this the pose I'm gonna do right now. There we go. That's good. So that looks good. So yeah. So. Yeah, so we're gonna do this thing. So look, as you can see, our sarco, our sarco buddy, has very great. We're just gonna start with the gimmick section for some reason. I don't know what else to do. Start with. Okay, so this is the gimmicks. So you see, there's this button right here, and look. It makes the mouth And also, if you turn it, same like the new Tarbosaurus, it turns its head. If you do this, like shake the tail a little bit, when you get it, go figure it out. It's supposed to turn its head, but its head is not that good at turning for it, so just turn it with your own hands. Because then it will lock in place like that. It will also move the tail, which makes it cool. And also, if you do this pose, you're in a treat. Because that is a good pose. Just look at it. The head to the side. Look like more like the head's to the side. The head's to the side, which makes it good. And it's like just like a good little art pose. I'm probably going to make a little drawing of Circus Hookus doing this pose like that. And just look to the side like that. And doing the thing that the crocodiles do. Why not? I'm so good at hissing noises. Why would I not? Also, why does it have this little bumpy boy on its snout? It didn't really need that, but maybe it's for extra teeth. So the top teeth are just on the butt, on the top are just really dangerous. And then the rest of the teeth are still dangerous, but less dangerous. Only the big ones are really dangerous. Also, it kind of looks like a cat. Meow. <laughs> I'm so perfect. Why does everybody make that joke? I'm pretty sure that's an old joke. Old folks. We already went to the gimmick section. So now to the articulation section. Can move its arms, both of its arms. I don't want to do both because it moves it out and and it's, it's, it, it, you can also do swimming poses. You can move the legs too. I mean, oh, this is so hard to hold a camera. Look, there's, it's, scan it. Scan it. Just pause the video, then scan it with your mobile device. 
Maybe don't do that. That my account is cheating. I don't care. Look, but just scan. I don't care. Do it. Do it if you want to. So it can do swimming poses. Unfortunately, come on, foot. You're supposed. To. Yeah, it takes two hands to do it. Okay, I'm getting it. What? What? Okay, there we go. So that's the first step of swimming pose. And you can do your other step. Then just bend the arms back. It doesn't look. Just bend the arms back far. Not that far. So just kind of far. So see, so won't break it. This is how it should look. See, swimming. This is okay. Dress that in. You got your swimming sarcasucus. There you go, boys. That's a tutorial on how to make it swim. I wanted to figure out how it would do that when I just got this. And I didn't expect it to be this big. Okay, so here's a seven-year-old tan compared to a sarcasucus. To a Mattel sarcasucus. That's big. So, yeah, it's pretty good. So, yeah, that, that's the articulation section. And I thought something else was articulate. Oh, no, no. So, now we go to the paint section. This is my favorite section because I wanted to do this. Look at those great eyes. Those eyes match perfectly. Like, there's a little off things about, like, a little brown on the sides. But, you know, it's good. It's good. Okay, let me zoom in there. Put it, see, see, see the eye? It's kind of, like, brown around the eye or black, which makes it have eyelashes. Why do you have eyelashes? You're not a mammal. Quiet. Don't tell me quiet, you little... Don't demonetize me. And don't, don't, YouTube, when you watch this video, just don't demonetize me right away. Because he thought I was going to say curse word. Of course, why would I do that? So, it has like brown on the top, which is signature to what you see, and then green on the bottom. I don't know why, but it gives it more of this, like, look of, like, yeah, that's, that's an animal, that, 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 that animal is, 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 that's a crop, that, 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 that's definitely from a swamp. When you see that's color, you just, says, your mind repeatedly says, that's from a swamp, that's from a swamp, that's from a prehistoric swamp, that's from a prehistoric swamp, that's from a prehistoric swamp. Mattel, you did a great job on this. If you didn't make Primal Jack, I'd be just going on an outrage like this. Oh, Oreo. Ore, 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 ore. Oh, uh, so yeah, under it, it has the little numbers for some reason on there for no, oh, it also has black spots, we can't forget the spot details to make it look more prehistoric -y and cooler, well, it does, have, it does have spots on the top, but you don't really notice them, so you can, it can look more prehistoric. Like, because you don't see them, but then it get, adds, like, a tint. Kind of, like, a tint of pre, pre, prehistory, prehistory. So, yeah, prehistoric times. And, um, under the body is extremely flat, which I don't like. You shouldn't have made it fatter. Well, it already is fat. Right? Get that but it was a big animal. It had to have a big stomach. It also was a carnivore, and they would like to kill stuff and eat. This was probably not a hyper carnivore. and just waited in the water like a normal crocodile would. Also, if you're a crocodile watching this, this is to you. This is your cousin. He's called the Sarcosuchus. Okay, crocodiles and alligators.
and Caymans, and Garials. It exclusively a gar one kind of Garial. Is it called a false false Garial? Or is it just okay? Ex especially Garials. Has a little bump on the nose. One species of girl has like little bumpy nostrils. Hello, I'm William Shatner. And you, you may not know this about me, but years ago, what? I was diagnosed with a sleep disorder. And like many of us, I prescribed sleep equipment. Did you know sleep is So, yeah, this is cool. Now we're going to the detail, and holy, there's a lot of detail. And I love that. So the plates that form the little spikes, the the, the plates that form the from the trademark crocodile spikes have like look like they look like one of the bluish gray bluish and gray blue and gray ankylosaurus toys from Mattel. So you did an outstanding job of that, Mattel. It um spikes so crocodile. So crocodile that I love it. It's this is exactly a sarcosuchus. Oh, it also has all the spikes on the back. But then one thing that makes me angry. The only thing that makes me super angry. See, so you don't you see. So it's just separate. But I know that an alligator or a crocodile. One of those two, they're one, they have the big spikes on their tail, and then it just separates into one, combines into one, two, two, two of them combining into one. You got that thing wrong, but at least it resembles a stegosaurus. Couldn't have used this for defense, like, because there's spikes. Wait, they're not spikes, they're scutes. I forgot that. Scutes. Scoot, scoot, scoot in the mouth. On camera, it looks so real because it has a good amount of detail. It has taste buds on it. It almost feels real. And it also has, I think this is the only figure with the most glossy tongue, which, since it's really glossy, makes it have the wet feel and makes it have a realistic tongue. See, this is my tongue. Oh god, what happened? See that? So you saw that. And then that. His tongue. They look almost the same. Let me do a recap. His tongue. They look so similar. Look so real. They just look so real. I love that, the fact they made that. Mattel, you did a great job on this figure. I appreciate it. I've always loved it, and um, I've always wanted it since Primal Attack come out. And since I figured, I saw that there was more of them. I wanted the Tarbosaurus more, but then I realized, yeah, Sarcosuchus is kind of better than the Tarbos Tarbosaurus. As clearly, you saw my Tarbosaurus review from the new Primal Attack. Primal Attack figures are good. But Mattel, you did a, the greatest job. Maybe one day you can make your own hybrid um, dinosaur thing. Just like Hasbro did. Don't make them like Hasbro, though. We're switching spots. Don't make them like Hasbro, though. Okay. Like you have, like, maybe make them have little weapons, like um, a blast. Kind of like Godzilla's atomic breath. And you can make a, like, Mattel, I would like that so much that I would immediately try to find one on, like, Google. And then we could, like, just do something. I don't know, but, oh, my stomach hurts. Uh, I might end this video soon because my stomach hurts. And I might have to go to the bathroom soon. I might poop in this video, and I don't want to poop on it. It looks like fans, like, you, maybe you're watching this when you're on the toilet, but, um, wait, this is not a nostril. That's the nostril, actually. Oh, God. Okay. Oh. Um, I might end the video here.
because I feel like I need a good need to take a number two. You know what I mean. Yeah. yeah, but I'm dying it. Oh, I hate these times. I hate these times. Uh, uh, I hate these times. I feel like I'm dead. But let's go on the review. And if you put it in the darker place, it just looks even swampier, which makes it a better perspective. They shouldn't have did like a coating of brown on the green. Like, Cause they kind of did, but they shouldn't have added more. They could just made it have a green tint. You might have not sold as much six there, but <laughs> makes it look kind of like this, like with, uh, like that, and then stuff. It's, 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 it's great. But it's a great figure. And I'm gonna end the video now. My stomach hurts, and I don't like this. I, 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 I